My name is Erin Baxter. Uh, I'm 15 years old and I volunteer at Otis Library for almost uh, four years now. I've been coming here to the library since uh, as long as I can remember, since it's a uh, like relocation, renovation, through it all, just it's just been a great place to learn how to, to read and to, um, to learn. And I know like my little sister, she's coming here too, and she just loves checking out books and doing the programs here. The programs here are great, the staff is great, and I just think it's a great place to really, you know, hang out, read, and work. The reason I like the Otis Library is because it offers many opportunities. Um, I love the activities that it offers and what we can do in the Otis Library. I like the Otis Library <laughs> because I can come and read uh, books and I can do my work and do more math because math is still very good. I like the library. The library is a very valuable resource for me to be able to work with many students from many different schools as a tutor. Um, today I have students from Teachers Memorial, Sacred Heart, Marine Science Magnet School, Kellyville School, Montville High School, Montville Middle School, Norwich Public Schools. It offers an open door policy which allows them to bring whatever material they need to work on along with any resources provided by the library to work on the material that needs to be the librarians, the staff are so helpful. Anytime we have a question or need any support services, they're here to provide it. I'm Catherine McNair. Um, I used to come to the library all the time as a kid. Um, I worked here when I was in college. I started off working in the children's department and in processing, and it was kind of cool to get to see all the, the background areas of the library, um, stuff you don't necessarily, necessarily see as a patron. Um, and then my senior year of college, once I knew I was going to school for accounting, I came here to work as an intern. So I got great experience working with QuickBooks. Um, I, now I'm on the other side, auditing all the not-for-profits and governments that I do. My name is Dave. I live in Norwich. I'm an honorably discharged vet. Uh, I've been unemployed for quite some time, and uh, as I found out uh, seeking uh, new employment, that uh, most companies are requiring you to apply online, and uh, I don't have a uh, computer at home or access to one in, uh, in my home. So uh, fortunately for me, the Otis Library provides this uh, necessary tool for me to seek employment. Uh, with, without the uh, computers here at the library and the wonderful staff that they have here to assist me in uh, operating this, uh, this wonderful new technology, I wouldn't be able to apply for the, the different jobs that I have. My name is Maddie and I am a resident services coordinator at Chase Manor Apartments here in Norwich. We have um, 103 elderly and disabled individuals who are also low income. We try and provide different services for them in the area because a lot of them are homebound um, and obviously elderly so they really are um, struggling to find connections in the community. Um, a couple months ago we had some interest in um, doing some reading groups and different people taking out books from the library but unfortunately transportation was a really big issue and uh, we contacted Otis Library and they have been absolutely phenomenal in providing um, a book drop-off program for our residents. Hello my name is Joe Sharkwitz and I've been a patron of the Otis Library since the late 80s. When I first moved to Norwich, um, I discovered the Otis Library. And I had been an artist before, but not a, a serious one. And I was trying to learn how to do watercolor, and I could never figure it out. And the library had a video uh, called Introduction to Watercolor. 
and it explained it to me, and I learned how to do it from there, and I've been working on it ever since with all the books that, uh, our books that the library has. It's been really beneficial to me.